Look at that. Is it still it's doing it? Is, it? is it five? It's 18? It just jumped to 18 just then. And another dangerous spike of radiation registered on our meters. Oh, wow. But we need to get out of here, guys. Let's get out of here. We had no explanation for what happened to the cow or what caused the radiation. Did you know that one of the most enigmatic places on Earth is right here in Utah for decades rumors of UFO sightings and encounters with extraterrestrial beings have surrounded this area yet no definitive proof has surfaced to confirm what's truly going on despite extensive investigations no hard evidence has been released to explain the strange phenomena perhaps the full story will remain hidden forever. But let's leave behind the giant U2 claw at Loveland Aquarium and dive into Utah's second. Most Mysterious Location Skinwalker Ranch located in the remote Uint Basin this sprawling 512-acre property has long been considered one of the world's most notorious paranormal hotspots reports from the ranch have included everything from glowing orbs and mysterious aircraft to inexplicable illnesses and terrifying encounters with shape-shifting entities. It's a place where the unexplainable seems to happen with startling regularity over the years Skinwalker Ranch has gained international fame inspiring countless books. Documentaries and Research Projects its dark reputation for strange occurrences has attracted the attention of government scientists and private researchers alike with some even suggesting that the ranch may be a focal point for interdimensional activity or other world portals the site's history is so compelling that it's become the subject of a History Channel series further fueling speculation about what could be lurking in the shadows of the Uint Basin. Whether it's UFOs cryptids or unexplained electromagnetic disturbances Skinwalker Ranch continues to baffle those who visit leaving many to wonder whether its secrets will ever be fully uncovered but how exactly did this remote patch of land in eastern Utah to global fame and how many of its bizarre tales should we actually believe the first question has a clear answer rooted in history and investigation but when it comes to the second we'll leave that up to you to decide history of Skinwalker Ranch the UTS and the Navajo the ominous reputation of Skinwalker Ranch is deeply Rooted in the history and folklore of its earliest inhabitants while the land lies within you territory the name Skinwalker has its origins in Navajo tradition derived from the phrase Inushi which translates to by means of it it goes on all fours in Navajo culture Skinwalkers are feared beings witches who have mastered dark magic allowing them to transform into any animal or human these shapeshifters are believed to possess supernatural abilities such as the power to control minds inflict curses and bring harm to those they Target Navajo lore about skinwalkers is shrouded in secrecy as discussing these beings is taboo even among Navajo people this has only added to their mystique and popular culture with tales of skinwalkers inspiring countless horror stories movies and urban legends the skinwalker legend gained particular prominence in connection with skinwalker ranch due to a specific story involving the Ute tribe according to tribal accounts during during the 19th century relations between the Ute and Navajo Peoples turned hostile some say this conflict escalated. During the forced removal of the Navajo from their homelands known as the Long Walk of One, 1864 and Navajo shamans in a final act of vengeance cursed the land the legend suggests that they unleashed skinwalkers to haunt the Ute tribe who had allied with the U.S. military during the conflict these skinwalkers it is said still stalk the land today carrying out the curse and sowing fear among those who wander too close to the ranch supporting these legends are numerous reports from both the Ute and Navajo who claim to have witnessed Strange and terrifying occurrences in the Uinta Basin over the years stories of eerie animal sightings such as large wolves that cannot be killed cattle mutilations and unexplained howls have all been attributed to the preceded presence of skinwalkers in fact in some accounts residents describe encounters with creatures that appear to be human but move in unnatural ways or display eerie glowing eyes reinforcing the belief that skinwalkers still roam the area adding to this mystique is the Ute. Belief that the ranch sits on forbidden land the Tribe avoids the area believing it to be a place of malevolent forces this long-standing cultural taboo has only strengthened the notion that there is something otherworldly about Skinwalker Ranch something that goes beyond what meets the eye the Shermans the idea of shape-shifting which is roaming the Uint Basin might sound far-fetched to some but not to the Sherman family in 1994 they purchased Skinwalker Ranch hoping to enjoy the quiet life in their new country home unfortunately what followed could easily be the plot of a horror movie 
From the very beginning the Shermans experienced bizarre and unsettling events on the ranch the most terrifying of which involved something that closely resembled a skinwalker one evening Terry Sherman heard a noise outside and stepped out to investigate to his shock he encountered an unusually large wolf far bigger than any he had ever seen alarmed he grabbed his gun and shot the wolf multiple times. But the bullets appeared to have no effect the creature eventually retreated but as Terry followed its tracks they mysteriously Vanished as if the wolf had dissolved into thin air was it an ancient skin walker that startled the family that night while we may never know this was just the beginning of the Sherman's disturbing encounters at the ranch over the next two years they reported a litany of strange phenomena including flashing lights and mysterious objects in the sky strange circles that appeared in their fields overnight disembodied voices floating through the air, and a series of gruesome cattle mutilations that left no clear Explanation The experiences were so terrifying that unlike the families in horror films who stubbornly stay in haunted houses the Shermans decided to sell the property before things got worse by 1996 just two years after moving in they had had enough the ranch was sold to real estate mogul Robert Bigelow who went on to launch an extensive investigation into the properties as paranormal activity. Through his National Institute for Discovery Science NIDS the Shermans experiences added to the growing lore surrounding Skinwalker. Ranch turning it into one of the most infamous locations for paranormal research in the world their story remains a focal point in the ranch's legend with many one wondering whether what they encountered was something beyond scientific explanation or perhaps the work of the ancient forces that have long haunted the land Robert Bigelow and Nighty who would be bold or perhaps foolish enough to buy a haunted ranch someone with deep pockets. And a passion for the paranormal of course enter Robert. Bigelow a millionaire with a serious interest in. The unknown in 1995 just a year before buying Skinwalker Ranch Bigelow had founded the National Institute for Discovery Science NIDS to fund research into UFOs and paranormal phenomena for Bigelow Skinwalker Ranch was the ultimate playground in 1996 he bought the 500-acre property from the Shermans and turned it into a research hub for his newly created NID skeptics however often point out that much of the evidence for paranormal activity on the ranch comes from the Shermans themselves who sold the property to a millionaire known for his fascination with UFOs some question whether the Shermans might have fabricated stories of mutilated cattle and shape-shifting wolves to lure in Bigelow or another buyer while that theory has sparked debate it doesn't hold much weight when you consider the facts the Sherman sold the ranch for around $200,000 a modest sum for a property of that size even in the nine suggesting they weren't out to profit but were instead eager to leave behind what they believed was a haunted nightmare so what did Bigelow and his team at NIDS uncover if they found definitive proof of UFOs or alien life they certainly kept it under wraps what has been revealed aligns eerily with the Sherman's original reports NIDS researchers recounted seeing strange creatures with glowing unnatural eyes and more mutilated cattle including one case that occurred in broad daylight within an hour of the cow being seen alive what was most unsettling about these mutilations wasn't just the precision with which the animals had been disemboweled but the complete absence of blood as though the animal's innards had been removed without leaving a trace while these stories add to the ranch's already eerie reputation many wonder why after years of research and millions of dollars no groundbreaking evidence ever surfaced one explanation ironically is that their technology itself became part of the mystery on multiple occasions expensive audio and visual equipment mysteriously failed to record what eyewitnesses had clearly seen whether it was large unidentifiable animals or glowing orbs in the sky the lack of physical evidence despite so many reported encounters only deepened the enigma nids was disbanded in 2004 but bigelow held on to the ranch until 2016 when it was sold to another group eager to investigate its strange phenomena like nids before them the new owners experienced many of the same unexplained anomalies and faced the same frustrations despite all the research an equipment Skinwalker Ranch remains as much a mystery today as it was when the Shermans first fled its eerie. Grasp Brandon Fugel and the His Channel in 2016 Robert Bigelow sold Skinwalker Ranch to a buyer who for a time chose to remain anonymous that changed in 2020 when Brandon Fugel a Utah real estate mogul revealed himself as the mysterious new owner with his announcement came the launch of The Secret of Skinwalker Ranch a History Channel reality TV show documenting Fugel's efforts. To approach the ranch's bizarre phenomena from a scientific perspective Fugel assembled a team of experts across 
multiple disciplines to investigate the ranch's mysteries the team includes astrophysicists engineers and even a man named dragon an unusual figure who adds a quirky element to the investigations like nids before them fugel's team seeks answers to questions that have puzzled researchers for decades why does electronic equipment malfunction so frequently on the ranch what's behind the wave of unexplained illnesses experienced by so many who visit why do people report feeling an overwhelming sense of strangeness that seems to follow them even after they Leave and of course there's the pressing question why is there a grown man named Dragon did he choose that name himself and does he insists that everyone calls him by it though the team employs advanced scientific methods like so many investigators before them they seem to uncover more questions than answers whether it's paranormal forces at work or something else entirely the search for explanations continues and Skinwalker Ranch remains a place where the unexplainable thrives other local tales the stories from Skinwalker Ranch may vary but they all share a striking commonality the unshakable belief that what's happening is real this conviction isn't limited to the ranch itself many in the surrounding you into basin have reported experiencing similarly strange phenomena since the 1950s hundreds of UFO sightings and other unexplained events have been recorded in the area suggesting that Skinwalker Ranch is just one piece of a larger puzzle neighbors of the ranch frequently report seeing bright mysterious lights in the sky some describe these lights as resembling doorways or portals while others speak of massive flying objects hovering silently overhead cattle mutilations a persistent theme in skinwalker lore also extend beyond the ranch's borders several ranchers in the area have discovered cattle seemingly struck by lightning without any signs of scorched earth nearby making the injuries even more puzzling one group of locals even recounted a chilling experience where after spending a night watching for UFOs they returned to find their car had mysterious moved with no tire tracks left in the sand to explain how it got there such tales whether fantastical or real add to the growing sense of unease and intrigue in the region and then there are the small yet strange modern day stories like that of the History Channel production assistants who according to rumor must deliver coffee to Dragon every day while perhaps not as terrifying as UFOs or shapeshifters it's another quirky detail. That adds to the legend of Skinwalker Ranch and its unique inhabitants so what's really going on? When it comes to explaining the mysteries of Skinwalker Ranch there's no shortage of theories and some are certainly more outlandish than others but given the bizarre nature of the phenomena reported it's only natural to explore a few possibilities theory one people are lying to get money this theory suggests that the strange reports from Skinwalker Ranch are, are a deliberate ploy for financial gain proponents argue that the Shermans and other witnesses might have exaggerated or fabricated their experiences to attract attention and drive up the value of the property while this theory may not be particularly exciting or imaginative it's worth noting that the Shermans sold the ranch for a relatively modest sum of $200,000 which might argue against the idea of a money-making scheme nonetheless it's always possible that some embellishment could be at play theory to extraterrestrial visitors the idea that extraterrestrials are behind the anomalies at Skinwalker Ranch is one of the most popular theories it suggests that the bright lights mysterious flying objects unexplained voices and the precise cattle mutilations could all be linked to alien activity this theory would explain the high level of secrecy and the strange behavior of the phenomena perhaps these extraterrestrials are conducting experiments or observing us but choose to remain hidden from direct contact maybe they're even filming their own doku series documenting human reactions to their presence these theories only scratch the surface of the speculation surrounding skinwalker ranch whether you lean towards the more Grounded explanations or the far-fetched ones the ranch continues to captivate and intrigue with its blend of mystery and the unknown theory three interdimensional visitors here's a twist on the extraterrestrial hypothesis what if the phenomena at Skinwalker Ranch are not the result of visitors from another planet but from a parallel dimension or alternate universe proponents of this theory argue that the mysterious lights and portals observed could be gateways or windows into these other realms. The idea is that these interdimensional beings might be slipping through these rifts causing the anomalies reported by witnesses this theory adds a layer of complexity to the enigma suggesting that what we perceive as UFOs or shapeshifters might actually be entities from dimensions that exist alongside our own theory for geophysical processes causing hallucinations prepare for a mind-bending theory what if the strange experiences reported at Skinwalker Branch are not the result of paranormal or extraterrestrial 
activity but rather the effects of geophysical processes on the human brain neuroscientist Michael Persinger proposed that certain environmental factors such as tectonic shifts seismic activity in geomagnetic fields could influence the brain in ways that induce hallucinations according to this theory the anomalies at the ranch could be a result of these forces altering our perception making us see things like shape shifters UFOs or portals. While this theory might seem far-fetched it presents a scientifically grounded explanation that suggests environmental changes might be impacting our sensory experiences can you visit skinwalker ranch if you're itching to explore skinwalker ranch yourself you're out of luck unless you have an invitation from the owners the ranch is private property and trespassing is not advised especially since the head of security is known to be exceptionally vigilant and rumor has it their name rhymes with dragon however you can still get close to the action by visiting nearby areas there's a campground just outside the Ranch offering UFO-themed ATV tours that claim to be the closest you can legally get to the ranch alternatively try your luck at UFO spotting from one of the state parks in the Uint Basin such as Stein Acre Starvation Reservoir or Red Fleet State Parks whether you spot a flying saucer or just enjoy the stunning scenery in star-filled skies a trip to the Uint Basin promises breathtaking views and friendly locals are theory Utah isn't just the best tourist destination in our world it might be the best in any world.